the fall of or summer or something like that. I have to check to see it in what the title is. Uh, I made a note <laughs> the other day. Uh, forgot the name, the, the correct name of the movie I was supposedly talking about. And then had so much trouble trying to to see what it is, where is it, because I then connect, make the connection between the note and the movie, but for that you have to find the movie. Uh, and it was, I thought, it, it, it is a love story. But it was a love song. Big difference. And then I said to myself, okay, I'll, I didn't find it with Tinte the Dragos. I mean, yeah, but this is, maybe they translated the, and then it's a love song. But anyway, uh, by Googling it like that, uh, I couldn't, it wasn't the name. So I said, okay, look in the uh, program for Cinemax because it was on Cinemax. And in the next days, it, it must come back again in schedule. It will be heard again. Because that's what they do. And it's only, I think, in, in, I don't know, near the end of what they have in September. Because they have the, the advantage that is in the program is that they have two, three lines telling you about the movies. Right? There's this woman uh, fishing and looking at nature. And I said, oh, that's, that's my movie. That's, that's me. But it's called a, a love song. <laughs> so it took me uh, half an hour to time wasted. What am I doing? Oh, Obama. Maybe this is the title. I have another half an hour to waste. <laughs> uh, of course, this is uh, a name, a creature, a monster that uh, has uh, been infamous uh, around the world. Infamous, by the way, is the world we should avoid. I've read a few days ago. The King, King's English, uh, King's Defense, Magista Budi, Magician, King of Comedy, and such a brilliant mind. I avoid genius because, as far as I can remember, Kundera said we should use that generously or wait for it. Da Vinci, Einstein, Shakespeare, okay, that's. These are geniuses for them. And it, it's true. Thomas Mann argued about love, friends. And, oh, I love this. I mean, it's, there's so much love. It doesn't mean anything in it. But I would venture to say that Ains Kingsley Ains is, is a genius for me. So, um, he, he has a few words. <laughs> he, he's. Uh, Hilariously um, explaining, analyzing that, and thinking, so and it looks at the way they started changing meaning or having two quite opposite to you, uh, for various people, so that you have to stop using it because you you will not be understood, and that's the point of. Some will understand, few, fewer, 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 fewer. Uh, so many names, uh, words. And then others will think, ah, oh, famous. No, infamous, infamy. So some of the London, of course, um, the mastermind of so much power, carnage, American carnage, to pull another idiot and monster from. This one, American male. Um, and one that needed to go and did go. And Obama would know that pictures and, and some of the images. Uh, 
gave the go-ahead to the operation and they put the helicopters in Pakistan near a military base or something, headquarters of the military in Pakistan. More than dubious men involved in so much wrongdoing, um, including evidence tolerating this part. And then the Marines shooting, killing him, and then dropping him in the ocean. And um, I think of the end of uh, an excellent movie, Charlie Wilson's War, with Tom Hanks as Charlie Wilson, the senator who pressed Congress and uh, the American administration to halt the Taliban uh, at the time when. In, in Afghanistan, when the Soviet Union invaded Afghanistan. And they did. Uh, some help, more help, more weapons. Uh, uh, that that happened yet. Um, and um, eventually the Soviets had to pull out that uh, calamity for them would precipitate the end of the Soviet Union, the fall of the Soviet Union, which would give us this other maxa, Putin, uh, who says the disintegration of the Soviet Union was the biggest uh, catastrophe of uh, the 20th century, not the Second World War, not the death of tens of millions. Uh, in the war, in the um, Stalin massacres, genocide, and so on. No, it was the but the end of the Soviet Union for, for Putin, which he wants to re-establish. Invasion of Ukraine, uh, to Crimea, had a war with Georgia, so on. and he's looking for trouble. That's uh, he, he, that's the way he keeps power. Saying, look, I keep order and I'm, I make keep Russia great. So at the end of Charlie Wilson's war, uh, we have Philip Simon Hoffman, who is the CIA uh, super intelligent uh, officer, uh, who tells the story of the Zen master, the Zen master, who has this horse, and the horse runs away, and the people from the village come and say, oh, that's so bad. And Master. We'll see, he says. Indeed, after some days, maybe, uh, the horse comes back, but with other wild horses. And this time the neighbors are happy for the man. Oh, it's a room. We'll see. Trying to tame one of the wild horses, the son of the Zen master falls and breaks his leg. This is again cause for uh, pain and, and <coughs> pity that the man is serene, Zen Master, and wishes. When the recruiters for the army, this is the Chinese in the Middle Ages probably, uh, come to take the man to fight in the wars of the Chinese emperor, uh, they don't expose him to the dangers those words, because he has a broken leg so he's... now this is cause for celebration for the villagers but the Zen master says yeah, we should see so it, the point being of course we we don't know and in the case of the movie um, we don't know it looks like we had a victory the Afghans with the weapons from the US uh, pushed back the Soviets, but then the same Taliban would uh, fight the Americans, would have uh, Bin Laden use the uh, territory to launch attacks on the US. And even now, they're the most, among the most gruesome ghouls in the world. 
in the news uh, every other week or so. How they ban schools, they ban women from uh, they, they, uh, terrorists still and, and inhuman.